Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today's video is, I'm too excited to even think straight. It is, it's an announcement video and it's a partnership video, I guess you could say. Um, a while back, Pineapple Fabrics um, put out the, a word on their social media that they were looking for brand ambassadors. And I thought, I'm going to give it a shot. My channel's tiny, but I really love Pineapple Fabrics. I love the company. I've been down there. I love shopping in there. And I'm going to go for it. I said, I just, I'm going to, I'm going to do it. So I wrote them a small email, you know, hi, my name is Shannon. Um, I'm a 50 year old crafter, um, that's learning to sew at 50 years old. I have done some very small, easy things like curtain balances, tablecloths, table runner, very, you know, just simple, simple sewing. And I want to learn to quilt. I want to learn to make quilts and I would love to learn with pineapple fabrics. And guys, they messaged me back. I can't, I can't, I can't even believe it. They messaged me back. So when they messaged me, they told me to go on their website and pick um, one of their their packs, one of their pineapple packs, which is like this. If you've seen my pineapple slice unboxings, it's a pack of fabric, and every pack is different, and every pack has a different lady's name. So each pack is configured differently with the fabric, the cuts of fabric. So this one I picked out is a Diana pack. And I've got my pack and slip here so I know what's what. Because, you know, I can't remember anything. <laughs> so, the um, the pineapple pack I picked is called Perched Owl. And the quilt pattern I picked, because you do get to pick a free pattern with your pineapple pack. Um, it'll give you a list of different ones you can choose from. It is called the Whirly Gig Quilt. Now, I was looking and I, I told them, you know, I'm a beginner. I'm looking for things I can learn, you know. So this is the Whirly Gig quilt pattern. And it says up here at the front, up at the top, confident beginner. <laughs> so um, this is the pattern. And when I was looking at it online, um, I thought, that looks, that looks like I could do that. That looks like I could do that. And um, it tells you all your instructions on the back. It tells you the fabric that you need. And... I, th I think we can do this. So if you would like to sew along with me in this, um, you need a, a Diana pack from Pineapple Fabrics, and I will leave them linked down below. And a pine one Diana Pineapple pack contains 10 pieces of 6.5 or 6.5, I'm assuming 6.5 by 43 inch strips so just really wide strips so that's what i have here are my six and a half by 43 inch strips all right guys i'm going to flip you down so you can see this absolutely beautiful fabric let me turn you guys down this way and i hope you guys can see yes it is more of a winter winter scene but this fabric is so beautiful i had to get this fabric um it's got these beautiful moons these beautiful trees these lovely like flowers so i mean it's not necessarily winter it's got these beautiful flowers and these beautiful beautiful owls okay i'm going to turn this back then this this one is just a white with silver and this beautiful kind of blue gray light blue gray just polka dots just dots randomly just sprinkled everywhere the next one is this beautiful kind of blue on blue with silver um, foliage just sprigs of beautiful foliage and more little flowers so not necessarily winter but it is very wintry to me the next one is white with these beautiful ferns and it's kind of aqua and i love aqua and this beautiful kind of muted blue gray love it and of course the silver sprinkled in and then i believe this is the last fabric is this the last fabric blue on blue again 
pine needles with these beautiful silver pine needles. This is Hoffman Fabrics. Yep, and then it starts over again. Look at that face. Look at that little face. Okay, so they sent me this. This is what I picked. This is I picked about three or four, and I said, well, send me whichever one you want to send me. Um, I like, you know, and I picked four different patterns. It's like, just send me whichever one you'd like to send me. And they sent me this one. Um, absolutely stunning material. I did not know they were going to send this. Because with your pattern, it takes one pineapple pack, it takes your batting, it takes your thread, of course, and it takes a half a yard of binding and one and two thirds yard of um, backing. I didn't know they were sending this. I did not know. So they sent, it looks like one, this might be one yard, I, I guess, because it just says one. I'm thinking it's one yard of uh, this is paintbrush studio painters palette in abyss it's a beautiful not a royal not a navy it's kind of in between it's not really a navy but it's not as bright as a royal blue such a pretty blue and then this one is hoffman fabrics perch ice blue silver and it says two so two yards maybe Guys, they sent extra fabric because I only need a half a yard and one and two thirds yards. So that is plenty, plenty, plenty of extra fabric. And all I need is my batting because I have thread. I have some thread. I actually have some blue thread somewhere that I can probably use with this. Maybe. I don't know what I did with my threads. They're here somewhere. But I hauled some blue thread. I just gotta find the blue thread. I gotta find it. Um, so yeah, we're going to be sewing this quilt. So if you guys would like to sew along with me, I will leave the link um, for pineapple down below. Like I said, the, the pineapple slice box is, box is always linked down below. And that's a fabulous box. If you guys didn't see my last one, um, this is the pot, the, the pineapple pack that came out of that. We also got honey. We got honey in that as well. That is like crazy, but we're going to be making this quilt. Um, and what is the size? It's a 45 by 60. Is this crib size? Um, I might add borders to that to make it bigger. If I do, I may have to expand my backing piece. I don't know. I don't know, but we could we can um we can make some pieces to go into that. No big deal. But yeah, I'm I might make it a little bit bigger than what it says. And that's the the nice thing about even though you've got a pattern, you can you can jazz it the way you want to. You know, you can jazz it. You can add borders to make it bigger. But this is what's coming up. So this is kind of like an introduction video to this project welcome to this channel guys um i'm so excited so this is what's going to be coming i am leaving on vacation like tomorrow um i don't know when this video will go up it'll probably go up while we're on vacation i will schedule it so when you're seeing this i'm probably in the bahamas fingers crossed weather stays good um when we get back we're going to start on this and this video will be in or this project will be in three parts this video the introduction the next video we're going to start cutting our fabric and building the blocks and we'll, we'll do that together and then once we've got our blocks we will do another video where we finish putting the quilt together and we actually finish the quilt backing batting binding all that stuff we put it together we finish it and then we get to see the finished quilt all right guys that is it let me know down below what you think of this fabric what you think of the pattern i'm so excited to be doing this there is another lady that they chose and i believe her channel or her blog she's got a blog as well is all about quilts um i will find that and i will link her down below because I can't wait to see what she's doing. I don't know what she's doing. 
Uh, I don't know what fabric she's used. So I'm excited to see what she chose and um, watch along with her. And I'm hoping I might have the pattern because I have several pineapple packs and I have several pineapple um, patterns. So I'm hoping whatever she's doing, that I might already have it and I can sew along with her. All right, guys, I will see you on the next one and we will be making a new quilt. <laughs>